Both houses of the Missouri General Assembly approved a finalized version of the state operating budget for the next fiscal year. The $28 billion plan provides funding for all state services, including education, infrastructure, health care, and more. As a result of a projected rise in state revenue, the budget calls for increases in funding for elementary and secondary education, while appropriations for colleges and universities will remain level. State employees will receive a modest raise, and the daily reimbursement rate for nursing home services will increase. The chairman of the Senate Appropriations Committee believes this budget leaves Missouri on solid financial footing for upcoming years. But I worked really hard to not leave or create any holes in the budget for the next year. I, and I think that there's somewhat of a temptation if you're going out the door, spend all the money and run. And I did not ever want to do that, and we did not do that. Still, some senators believe more should be done to help the state's most vulnerable residents. How do you s reconcile the fact that we're 44th in the country in teacher salaries, we're 49th in state employee pay, you know, we're, we're lagging at the back of how many folks are eligible for our Medicaid. We didn't expand Medicaid. The approved budget legislation now heads to the governor's desk for his consideration. Reporting from the state capitol in Jefferson City, I'm Zachary Rieger.